my dear students welcome back to our channel in this video i will be explaining the mba fourth semester subject data mining for business as prescribed by usmania university and other universities of telangana we will go through the important questions and answers one by one let's begin with a quick revision unit 1 first important short question is define data mining data mining is the process of finding useful patterns trends and relationships in large sets of data it helps businesses make better decisions by understanding the hidden meaning in the data in simple words data mining means digging into data to find valuable information just like a miner digs into the earth to find gold example suppose a mobile company studies customer usage data using data mining they find that users aged 18 to 25 mostly recharge on weekends so they launch weekend special offers for that age group to increase sales key uses of data mining finding customer buying habits detecting fraud in banks improving business strategies predicting future trends easy tip to remember data mining is equal to data plus patterns plus smart decisions it helps turn raw data into useful knowledge for business success next important short question is to what is knowledge discovery in databases kdd knowledge discovery in databases kdd is the full process of finding useful knowledge from large amounts of data data mining is one step inside kdd like the heart of the process in simple words kdd means turning raw data into useful knowledge by going through different steps like selecting cleaning and analyzing data steps in kdd 1 selection choose the right data 2 cleaning remove errors or missing data 3 transformation convert data into the right format 4 data mining find patterns and trends 5 evaluation check if the results are useful example an online shopping website uses kdd to find that most orders come during festivals This helps them prepare offers and stock products in advance. Easy tip to remember. KDD is equal to full process, data mining is equal to one step in it. It helps businesses move from data information smart decisions. Next important short question is 3 list any to data mining tasks. There are two main types of data mining tasks. one classification and two clustering one classification classification means putting data into categories or groups based on some rules example a bank uses classification to find out whether a customer is high risk or low risk before giving a loan it checks customer income credit score and past history to decide two clustering clustering means grouping similar data together without predefined labels example an e-commerce site groups its customers into clusters like frequent buyers seasonal buyers and one time buyers based on shopping behavior easy tip to remember classification is equal to predefined groups like pass fail clustering is equal to natural groups like friend circles Both tasks help businesses understand customers and make better decisions. Next important short question is: Four mention any two motivating challenges in data mining. Data mining is powerful, but it also faces some challenges. Two major challenges are: one, handling large volumes of data. Today. Businesses collect huge amounts of data from websites, apps, and social media. It becomes difficult to store, process, and analyze such big data quickly. Example: 
an online shopping site like Amazon deals with crores of customer records. Mining useful patterns from this data takes time and resources. 2. Data quality and noise. Sometimes the data is incomplete, incorrect, or contains errors. This is called noisy data and it can lead to wrong conclusions. Example If a customer's age is written as 250 instead of 25, it can confuse the system and spoil the results. Easy tip to remember Big data is equal to hard to manage. Bad data is equal to bad results. These challenges motivate researchers to create better tools and smarter techniques in data mining. Next Unit 1 Long Questions First important long question is 1. Introduction to Data Mining Data mining is the process of exploring large sets of data to discover useful patterns, trends, and relationships. It helps businesses turn raw data into valuable information for making better decisions. In simple words, data mining is like digging into data to find hidden gold, useful knowledge that is not directly visible. Why is data mining important? Every business collects data from sales, customer feedback, website visits, and more. But this data is useless unless analyzed. Data mining helps companies understand customer behavior, improve marketing strategies, detect fraud or errors, predict future trends. Example, a supermarket uses data mining to find that customers who buy bread also often buy jam. This insight helps them place these items together in the store and boost sales a technique called market basket analysis. Main steps in data mining 1. Data collection gather raw data. 2. Data cleaning remove errors or duplicates. 3. Data selection and transformation choose and format data. 4. Data mining apply algorithms to find patterns. 5. Evaluation check if the results are useful. 6. Knowledge Presentation – Show findings in charts or reports Where is data mining used? Retail – To understand customer buying habits Banks – To detect credit card fraud Healthcare – To predict diseases from patient data E-commerce – To suggest products like Amazon's customers also bought Easy tip to remember Data mining is equal to data patterns business decisions. It's not just about storing data, but about using it smartly to grow the business. Data mining is now a key tool for modern businesses. It saves time, increases profits, and improves customer satisfaction by using data in intelligent ways. Next important long question is, Two Knowledge Discovery Process in Data Mining The Knowledge Discovery in Databases, KDD, process is a step-by-step -step method used to find useful knowledge from large sets of data. Data mining is just one step in this full process. In simple words, KDD is like cooking a dish, from choosing ingredients to serving the final meal. Each step is important to get useful results. Steps in the knowledge discovery process 1. Data selection Choose the right data from available sources. Example, from a bank's full database, only customer transaction data is selected. 2. Data cleaning Remove errors, duplicates or missing values. Example, correct spelling mistakes, remove blank entries. 3. Data Transformation Convert data into a suitable format for analysis. Example, change dates into a common format, group similar data together. 4. Data Mining This is the heart of the process. Apply algorithms to discover patterns or trends. Example 
Use techniques like classification or clustering to group customer types. 5. Pattern Evaluation Check which patterns are meaningful and useful. Remove unnecessary or common patterns. Example, ignore common knowledge like people shop more during festivals. 6. Knowledge Presentation Show results in charts, graphs, or reports for easy understanding. Example, a pie chart showing most purchased product categories. Real-life example, an online store uses the KDD process to study sales data. After cleaning and analyzing it, they discover that customers aged 18 to 25 buy the most mobile accessories on weekends. This knowledge helps them plan weekend discount offers to boost sales. Easy tip to remember. KDD is equal to select clean transform mine evaluate present. The knowledge discovery process helps businesses turn raw data into valuable insights, making smarter decisions and improving performance. Next important long question is 3. Motivating challenges in data mining Data mining is very useful, but it also comes with some challenges that make the process difficult. These are called motivating challenges because they motivate researchers and businesses to improve tools, technologies, and methods. In simple words, these are the problems faced while trying to dig useful information from large data. Top Motivating Challenges in Data Mining 1. Huge Volume of Data Modern businesses collect massive amounts of data every day from websites, apps, social media, etc. Handling, storing, and processing this huge data quickly is difficult. Example, Amazon has data from crores of customers. Analyzing this much data takes time, tools, and storage. 2. Data Quality Issues Sometimes data is incomplete, incorrect, or contains noise errors. This affects the accuracy of results. Example, if a customer's age is saved as 300, it will confuse the system and affect decision-making. 3. Privacy and Security Concerns When handling personal data, companies must ensure data is not misused or leaked. Example, if a hospital uses data mining, it must protect patient records from hackers. 4. Changing Data, Dynamic Data In many cases, data keeps changing, real-time data, so mining must happen quickly and regularly. Example, in stock markets, prices change every second. So real-time analysis is needed. 5. Difficult to interpret results Even after finding patterns, it is not always easy to understand or apply them. Example, a pattern may show high clicks but low sales, but the reason may not be clear. Easy tip to remember. Big data plus bad data plus privacy plus speed plus meaning is equal to major challenges. These challenges push developers and businesses to keep improving data mining tools for faster, safer and smarter decisions. Next important long question is. 4. Origins and Tasks of Data Mining Origins of Data Mining Data mining is not a new concept. It developed from the combination of three main areas. 1. Statistics for analyzing and interpreting data. 2. Artificial Intelligence, AI, for creating smart algorithms. 3. Databases for storing and managing large amounts of data. In simple words, data mining started when people needed better ways to find useful patterns in the huge amount of data stored in computers. Example, in the 1990s banks began using data mining to detect credit card fraud by analyzing customer transaction patterns. Tasks of Data Mining Data mining has several tasks or activities that help businesses find knowledge from data. 
The main tasks are 1. Classification Sorting data into categories based on known labels. Example, marking emails as spam or not spam. 2. Clustering Grouping similar data without predefined categories. Example Grouping customers into high spenders, budget buyers, etc. 3. Association role mining Finding relationships between items. Example People who buy mobiles also buy phone covers. 4. Prediction Using past data to forecast future outcomes. Example Predicting next month's sales based on last year's data. 5. Anomaly detection Identifying unusual data or behavior. Example, spotting a sudden large transaction in a bank account, possible fraud. Easy tip to remember. Data mining origin is equal to statistics plus AI plus databases. Tasks is equal to classify, cluster, associate, predict, detect. Conclusion Understanding the origin helps us know how powerful data mining has become. Learning the tasks helps businesses use the right tools to make smart decisions.